Hey everyone, I'm Thomas 64 here, and today we're going to turn on some more Barman Land for the Nintendo Wii. This is probably the true finale. So, in the last part we take care of the supposed finale, but this time we're really going to take care of it. Huh? Oh god. Alright, they're going to announce the champion's rules for the special final ranking battle. I'm confiscating all of your zone pieces. You start the final wrecking battle with zero. Of course you laugh at that. What's more, you start with zero tokens. You won't be allowed to check standings either. Maybe you can find some more tokens on the ground or something and play with the attraction with those. And seeing as cute pink is so smitten by my charms, I'm giving her a special promotion. I'm taking Bodyguard 1 out of the Zinc Energy Zone and putting in Q Pink instead. Now, now, none of that booing. <laughs> what? No zone pieces or tokens? That just isn't right. You said it, leader. It's not fair. But it's interesting to find somebody even more ruthless than the leader. True, true. Shut it. If you got something to complain about, tell it to that white guy over there. Oh, this guy is racist beyond belief. If it weren't for him, I wouldn't have to take away your pieces and tokens. Gah, it makes me mad all over again just thinking about it. I'm adding another rule just for you. If you don't win first place in a final ranking battle, you'll be banished from Barman Land. Ah, crap. Now look what you've done, Anton. Yeah, why'd you have to go and ruin it for the rest of us? The person you ought to be getting mad at is the champion. The message I ought to give you mad as anyone I feel like. Now I keep pink is getting closer and closer to the champion. I don't care what the zone is, I say bring it on. I'm going to defeat the champion and save Q Pink. <laughs> So, we have to pick tokens up off the ground and try to try to get pieces that way, huh? This really is a, going to be a tough zone if we have to look down the whole time we're competing. But we have to get through it somehow and defeat the champion, dude. And I can't, and I think the only people who can take it on this almost impossible tax are me and one other person. Wow, that really raised my hopes. Alright, so let's say just because. Because I want to save after that cutscene. Alright. You can warp to the energy zone for the final wrecking battle, which you don't get tokens. Want to warp? Let's see. Alright, I think I have enough for that. Let's do it. This is it. This is pretty much the true finale at this point. I mean, why would they have this set up and then it says like, oh, no, this is the semi-final. The final ranking battle. This is it. Everyone starts the special final ranking battle with zero tokens. I'm afraid they won't give you any of the information desk either. Dang it. All areas will be open to you. The attractions will be harder this time, and you won't be allowed to check standings. We hope you have fun anyway, though. So you pretty much left at the dust, just scattering all around just to get tokens. So all I can assume to do is pretty much just talk around the people, unless... Hey, what? Before you can play, you need some tokens from the information desk. What? I thought they said I couldn't get any from them. Freaking liars. I'm sorry, but I'm afraid I can't have any tokens. The champions rules state that everyone starts this with zero tokens. Hey, Anton. Are you seriously going to pay to, with the tokens you pick up, dude? A handsome guy like me has tons of fans wherever he goes, especially with the ladies. Oh, God. The lady at the information gate gave me some extra tokens on the sly. Here, I'll share with some with you. How many did you share? Hey, I found that on. I've been looking for you. 
Jeez, the saturation on this. Hey, wait, everybody. So this is pretty much the final reunion, I guess. Phew, I thought I'd find you all here. The Dancing Queen gave me some tokens. She said she wouldn't be needing them anymore. You guys need tokens, right? Find me some handsome guys and I'll find you some of mine. I picked up a whole bunch and now I have tons. I'll get, ugh. Here, I'll give you some. Aren't I nice? Actually, it was Kid Blue and I who picked them up. You know how the leader is. He thinks what his is his and what's ours is his. I just had an idea. Why don't we pull our tokens together and divide them up? That way, we can we friends can start all start on an equal footing. All right, that sounds good. But I'm definitely not gonna let any of you beat me. Well, I certainly have no intentions of losing either. So we see who does the best among friends, huh? Sounds exciting. I want to be the one who defeats the champion. He needs to be punished for playing with my innocent heart. I won't let him get away with making fun of my best friends. Oh yeah, this is definitely it. I got 12 tokens. I have 21 tokens. That be that makes me better than Cool Blah. I have 27. <laughs> Uh, gee, Q-Pink, that's substantial. That's 60 tokens altogether. That's We have quite a few, so... These are six of us. So I'm pretty sure that means... Let's see, 60 divided by 6. And yes, I can obviously tell that's 10, but... Let me just act like that. That's exactly 10 tokens each. Of course they tell me that. So now we can all do this. Of our friendship and these tokens, we can't lose that we can't lose to that old champion. Yeah. Okay, starting with right now, we put our friendship on temporary hold. We're rivals now, dude. And now that we're rivals again, there's no way I'm gonna let you beat me. Right. You can play ten tokens worth of attractions. Yes! <laughs> Alright, the true rivalry begins right now. So this is it. I have to win in order to get through this. And of course he makes it... Okay, I have to check my battery constantly because I have to make sure they don't die out on me on this. Because if it does die out on me, you know what that means. A thousand... Just for E? Oh god, I can barely make it. I can barely make it. I can just barely make it. Ah, okay. Uh, come on, 2000, 2000, 2000? Yeah! Dude, oh yeah. Uh, which one's this again? Space tube, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, these really are more difficult. Well, really, it's not much as difficult as they are with the different requirements being met. That's it. Other than that, the layout pretty much the same with everything. So, there's not really much different. There's not really much that's different as far as challenge goes. Except for, you know, the requirements being met, have to be met in a different standard. But, you know, it's not bad. Because all I gotta do is just play like a freaking pro. Which is basically what I've been trying to do this whole time. Yeah, alright. And yes, this is the rank we need in order to, uh, this is how much we need just for rank E. Fortunately, these tokens give you a ton. No! Hmm. 
Nope. At least there's only, uh, there's not 10 exactly, so I can do this again. Cause like, there's three here, there's three in the other, and there's three in the other one, so all I have is basically one, uh, one re attempt to play this if I, if I plan to do all the attractions and or the, uh, what is it, and or the multiplayer. Then again, the multiplayer gives you very few, so it's not even worth my time. Like, you get one, and it pays for three. But here, I can just get that with a D rank in one of these attractions. Maybe even a C, well, maybe, yeah, probably just a D rank. Because I think you get five if in a C rank, and B for seven. And I know A is ten. So basically, I can't waste too much time on re uh, re attempting this stuff. I have to try the other t activities as well. Ah, oh, come on, I just got through from saying that. I'm too used- I'm, I'm just too used to go vacation. I have to accept that. Did I give you 50 points each in score? Apparently. Alright, let me just go straight through the middle. I'm going right through the middle. And I can just barely touch those tokens. Awesome. All right. Yeah, there's not really much I can say here now. Oh, yeah, you can jump over the enemies too. At first, I thought you couldn't, but I guess you can. Oh, oh, it doesn't matter. I got what I needed. Yeah, 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 I can't check. I'll be mad if you have to play absolutely perfect throughout this whole thing. Like, you screw up once, you basically lost or anything like that. I know you can't screw up too much in this area. Yeah! Alright. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't, can't see the stuff. Blah, blah, blah. What? Okay, that was weird. What the? Okay, it's still two batteries. Just making sure. Alright, so what is it? Bomber fishing, a submarine, and Mecha Bomber Showdown. Please let Mecha Bomber Showdown go good here. Like a good, you know, that thing people do with, uh... That thing people do when they, what is it? Do the speedrun. A uh, split, yeah. Make it a good split, even though this is no speedrun at all. Because of all the re-attempts I had to do, would probably be a fail at the beginning. Right, let me aim for this guy first. Come on, shoot him now, shoot him now. Yeah. What? I already lost that? D! I forgot the requirements changed. Aw, oh, crap. So I basically gotta do this in one cycle instead. Oh, all right. I'll take B. Yeah, 
Aim to be a logical champion. I'm gonna be the one who becomes a champion. Alright, is there any good ones? Oh yeah, the skateboarding uh, attraction. Let's go there instead. Uh, where was the air? Oh, there it is. Uh, I can't believe this is pretty much the near finale. What? Okay, there's other bombers here. Maybe I can ask them for tokens too? Probably not. I think it's pretty much just for the multiplayer attractions. I'm gonna go all the way across just to go to the skateboarding and probably that other attraction I thought was difficult. Ski jump, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I will never get uh, a rank at that because of how different it is. Uh, skateboarding is right here, right? Yeah. Alright, let's do this. It sounds like we can't just have this sideways. We have to have it like this. Like, if it was sideways, I can at least accept having to hold, like, pressing the two button or something like that. Or holding the two button and shaking the remote up, but nope, it's just upright. Alright, 7.30 just for the first one. Kind of weird how the animations just flip like that. But then again, I'm no animator, so I can't judge. We are. Okay. I gotta make sure I make a precise jump because if you jump too late, you hit the very you hit the very edge. Jump too early, and you hit that very same edge. You can touch the tires and stuff, but not when they're like that. Do you go faster? Maybe not. Most of the time, I'll just do super jumping, not to uh, just to not take the risk. Yeah, especially when most of them tend to require it anyway. Yeah, you do get faster. At least this way, I can time the jumps easier. There we go. And you can't, oh by the way, when you're crouching you can't jump. There you go. Even, I should probably stop this because like I should uh... Cause like I'm right here anyway, I already got A. I'm trying to find a good way to wipe out. Oh that's a way, not a good way but a way. Yeah, yeah, I can't tell me because of the champion's rules. Blah, blah, blah. I think I have two tokens left. I can't believe I'm actually gonna waste one on radio control. It's that bad. Oh, I got three left. Alright, I'm good. Uh, now, in case you didn't already see this one, if you weren't at the stream, that is, uh, you play with it sideways. Does it look like a perfect setup for a D-pad? Yeah. Whoops. I'm sorry. You have to use the tilt controls. The only, the best way to get. The, oh crap! And the thing is, realizing before how difficult it was just trying to make through this in 130. Imagine how insane it is trying to get to 43 seconds. Then again, I did stuff 45 before, and if I'm not hitting this stuff like an idiot, I'd make it. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not even through, I'm only through, I'm already through the halfway point and I didn't even touch the end of this yet. So at most, if I'm lucky, I'll get, probably get a B. It'd be a miracle if I get an A. Go. Alright, so, no A rank, but not complaining. It's not something I'd work, not something I call worth trying again. Besides, I still got the other attractions to do. 
Yeah, yeah, can't tell me. Blah, 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 blah. Alright. On to ski jumping, because that's, that's not fun already. Can't imagine how insane it is the A rank requirement must be, because I can't even time the jump. I could probably time the jump just right. But as far, but as much as the balance, uh, getting the balance, like, like right on the mark. All right, a hundred, not bad, but not good since the two hundred is the is the minimum requirement for this. One eighty four. That's bad. Not if I don't even touch two hundred. If hundred from this, and this was a total waste. Come on. All right. Like it only counts if you land. If you fall, you don't get anything. All right. And what will be my last attraction? Not the multiplayer because I said that already. Made that clear enough. Alright, so I cleared everything in this area, not to mention I already cleared all the stuff in the lobby area, so It's the last area which I haven't covered, which is not the multiplayer, but the one on the opposite side So, I guess bomber fishing is gonna have to do It's either that or submarine, and I really don't like that one, so, yeah while we're fishing it is, and hopefully everything goes right with that. With that. Here it goes. Yeah, my battery's still kicking in. Whoops. Yeah, it's this kind of thing again. You have to move, and instead of just moving up or down, you have to move it back and forward this time. Got the control on this one so bad. Why couldn't I just simply move it, uh, move it up and up and down instead of having to move it forward and back? Because it gets like a delayed timing on this too. That's the thing. Dang it. Well, it's not bad. I mean, it could be a lot worse. Dang it. Well, at least I got a C rank. If I got that other fish again, I probably would have got a, uh, a B rank instead. But, that's it. All the tokens are gone, so... This is it. This is the thing we've all been waiting for. So if I don't win this, remember, I'm off. Remember, you have to, I think you, I'm not sure about this one. I think you have to be first to win this one. Or just be in the top five, because I think it said you have to win. But then again, the champion probably said to be first. Wouldn't be surprised. Hopefully this is it. Take a moment to breathe. First off, people being demoted, which really does not matter to any of, of the top 10, which is us. 16 through 12. People moving out. People being held back. And... <gasps> I'm not being held back. Sweet. The championship challenger... Which is me! 
of 62 pieces. To be fair, I could have got a, all 100. And since I was first, I'm pretty sure I get something out of that. A couple of things, actually. Challenge champion. I qualified, so blonde ponytail. Of course. Bear midriff top. Oh my god. Championship jacket. Oh, I'm so. I wonder, I wonder if I get more out of that. Oh dear god. Oh dear god. Please return to the bomber center until the championship battle. Oh god, this is it. This is all we, what we all been waiting for. Bomber center. Well, aren't you lucky? The championship has a message for you, Anton. <laughs> he said he'll be waiting for you in the championship, uh, championship, champion stage. And if you can defeat all the bodyguards on the champion stage, he said he'd fight you. Ha 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 ha. You have to defeat all of them. If you lose to even once, he said you'd be banished. Ha 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 ha, banished. That's the message. No way you'll ever be able to beat all those bodyguards. <laughs> Long live the champion. Ha 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 ha. The rule is you have to defeat all the bodyguards first before you can take on the champion. Even if you lose even once, you'll be banished from Barman Land. So the champion is gonna tire Anton out of a bodyguard battle first, huh? By the time Anton fights him, he'll be exhausted. That's pretty low, dude. Hey, it's not like Team Gold to Brood. We don't have anything. We don't. We have to try doing something. We don't. I don't care what. I gotta stop doing that. Or. <laughs> So, this wasn't the finale either. So yeah, if you heard the message in the very beginning, you pretty much got exactly what I was trying to point out here. So yeah, in the next part, <laughs> in the next part, this is pretty much going to be the finale of the game. <laughs> uh, so so this is Actor 64 signing out. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> You guys thought this was the finale. How hilarious. <laughs>